PG&E is trying to store energy from the sun for times of peak consumption, just like today. Near Vacaville, the utility is trying to devise ways to hold on to power. KPI X5's Wilson Walker shows us how this works and why it's a crucial part of the renewable energy future. So it's 90 something degrees right now at nine in the morning and there's a heater on in here. Correct. That's amazing. Well, again, like, yeah, it has to stay liquid. Just outside of Vacaville, PG&E is conducting an experiment with the future. Like I said, this is not your normal substation equipment. It's actually a set of sodium sulfur batteries linked together to make one massive battery with the intention of solving the primary challenge presented by renewable energy. That load's going up, your generation's coming down. It's 11 o'clock, it's already 100 degrees, and the 9,700 solar panels behind me are doing their thing. They're taking the sun and turning it into about two megawatts of power, but our peak demand for that power doesn't come until later in the day, so wouldn't it be nice to take that energy and hold on to it just for a couple of hours. And so that is then going to be feeding into the batteries that we see here and we'll be able to harness that energy and send that back onto the grid uh, when there's that peak demand in the evening. Now it works. It does work. But it only works on a small scale, about one megawatt. So PG&E is tinkering with this idea, now trying a lithium ion Tesla battery up in Yuba County. We're testing these various technologies to be able to figure out what works best, how we can best integrate these into our distribution operations. In fact, the technology is evolving so fast that this battery is already kind of outdated at just a few years old. Anything new would probably look very different. Oh, yeah. Probably much smaller, depending on the, the needs of the customers in the area. But the idea, storing power for release on demand, is the holy grail in the world of energy. So think of this battery as a glimpse of the future. The idea, the idea is still the same. In Solano County, Wilson Walker, KPIX 5.